Guys, what's going on? I hope you guys are well. I hope you guys are staying safe. I hope everything's good wherever you guys are. Guys, an unbelievable turn of events. Um, I was going to go inside, you know, have a copper um, and get my stand on and do a video. But I thought, nah, I just got to do it in the car. Uh, it's too big. Apparently, guys, there's been a lot going off today. So Tyson Fury um, came out and said, which I thought was shocking, by the way. He offered Alexander Usyk 70-30, which again proves the fact that Tyson Fury is all about the money. He's always been about the money. The man talks a lot of crap. And um, I, think that's a, I think that's very unfair. I think it's absolutely embarrassing for, for someone like Usyk to get 30%. I mean, his last fight was with AJ, who arguably, not arguably, is a bigger draw than Tyson Fury. And he, if AJ took 50-50 because he lost. Um, Tyson Fury is a bigger star But Usyk brings a lot more marbles um, I think it should be minimum 60-40, 50-50 I, I, like, 70-30 is a joke, by the way I think it's a joke um, I think it's an absolute joke um, Yeah, I think it's a joke um, Especially when you think about it That Usyk's last payday was probably 50 million Usyk's last payday was probably around 50 million So this isn't a guy that's not made huge money He's made big money he made 50 million against AJ in his last fight. So we're talking about a guy that's made mega millions. Um, unbelievably, which I thought that's it, though that's the fight done. Usyk comes back and accepts 70-30. What a man. But he puts a condition on that Tyson Fury. I think I, I didn't understand what he said properly, but it seemed like he said Tyson Fury needs to donate one million pounds to Ukraine. I, I don't know what he said exactly, but something like that. And you have to you have to say what a man, you know. If he actually accepts this fight for seventy thirty, Usyk, I want I I always wanted Usyk to win the fight, but now I want Usyk to win the fight even more. I want Usyk to win this fight and beat Tyson Fury. I want it. I want him to beat him bad. And I think I'm not the only one. I think a lot of people want to see Usyk beat Tyson Fury. I think Tyson Fury might even go into this fight as the villain, and and his own British the own British people might be cheering on Usyk. At this rate, um, with the way the way it's it's gone and the way Fury's acted, I think the Furies behaved disgustingly. Even Simon Jordan, who's the biggest Fury fan, came out and said, "If Tyson Fury doesn't sign this fight, he's a joke." And I think Tyson Fury's come out and acted this way because out of pressure. And that's why I saw a video where he was rattled and he came out and calling Usyk all kinds of names. The reason why you're seeing Tyson Fury act like this, because a lot of people are criticizing Tyson Fury and Fury's acting, rea uh, reacting um, erratically. Um, and um, U U Usyk's come out and just hit him with, I mean, if Usyk is serious about the 70-30, which I think he is, I think he's a fighting man. He's always been a fighting man. He's always been a proper fighting man. You know, Usyk's a proper fighting man, not Fury. I mean, Fury and his family like to go on like they're the... No, no, Usyk's the fighting man. He fought everybody at Cruiserweight. He's fighting everybody at Heavyweight and he's trying to make it happen at Heavyweight. I think the guy's, I think the guy's an absolute legend. Um, I, there's no messing around. He wants to fight the best. He believes in his skills, believes in his talent. And for me... Like I said, I think there's a lot of people now wanting him to do a number on Tyson Fury, uh, especially if Fury, get, you know, ask him to take 70-30, uh, which I think is embarrassing, by the way. I think for, for someone like Usyk to be getting 30% is a joke. A joke, especially when he holds three belts and his last fight, he got 50 million for it. I mean, it's embarrassing, but, you know, he's willing to make it happen because he believes in his skills. He believes he's going to beat Tyson Fury. Fair play to the guy. Fair play to the guy. Fair play to Alexander Usyk. You know, you deserve everything you get. Um, and to be honest with you, I don't think it's fair. And he, what, what made me laugh is he came out and he's called him Greedy Belly. Greedy Belly. Greedy Belly. You know, it was well funny. Oh my God, it was it was hilarious, that bit. But yeah, man, I, 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 I'm, I just want the fight to happen. Obviously, we don't get paid, so we don't care. But I still want to see Usyk get a fair split. I think 60-40 would be fair in Fury's favour. I think 70-30 is a liberty. I think it's taking advantage of, 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 of Usyk. And I don't think, I think Usyk deserves more than 30%. Um, I think a fight of this magnitude, the only reason it's big is not because of Fury. People keep going on, oh, it's Fury. No, no, it's, it's big because Alexander Usyk is a great fighter and People view Alexander Usyk as a legitimate threat to Tyson Fury. Um, and I, I think that Tyson Fury, he's made himself look really bad. Fury in the last couple of weeks has made himself look horrible.
And now Usyk has backed him up in a corner. Usyk's backed him up in a corner because Usyk... Tyson Fury offered him 70-30 thinking that Usyk won't accept. He won't accept it. Usyk's come out and accepted 70-30. So now... And now we're going to find out if the fight happens because Usyk's accepted the fight. Usyk's accepted 70-30. He's willing to take that deal. So now it's over to Fury to show us if he's really a fighting man or is he a guy that never really wanted to fight Usyk because of the fact that he knows it's a dangerous fight. Um, I think Us I think Fury knows. I think Fury knows that this guy's very good. I think Usyk. I think Fury knows this guy's very good, and I, and I don't think he wants any part of him. I've always said it from day one. I've said that I I don't think Tyson Fury really wants to fight Alexander Usyk. I think he knows deep down that the guy's very skilled and the guy's on another level. Um, Fury's not stupid. He's very intelligent, very sharp. His family's very intelligent. They know boxing, and I think they know that this guy's going to be a problem. He's gonna be a problem. I think Usyk beats Tyson Fury. I've said it. I've said it from day one. I'm not. I'm not gonna change my mind. I think he beats Tyson Fury. Um, and and I think Tyson doesn't want any part of it personally. I, I, I would be surprised if he does take that fight. But I, I think I think what Tyson Fury's done is he's done us. He's basically what he's done. He's basically put a, a put an offer out there that if. If if Alexander Usyk does accept it, it's too good an offer for him to turn it down. Um, so Fury's being greedy. Of course, we know he's always says that he'll fight for free, and he's not about the money and this, that, and the other. Well, clearly he is. Um, and like I said, it'll be it, it'd just be pleasurable for me to see if Alexander Usyk can come out victorious, and then hopefully Fury gets his pants pulled down. I, I don't think I think if Fury gets beat by Usyk, I don't even think he'll take the rematch. I think Fury will just run off into the sunset. To be honest with you, I don't think he'll care if he gets beat by Usyk personally. That's just my opinion. Um, I, I generally don't think. Um, I, I don't think he wants. I don't. I, I generally don't think he really wants to fight Alexander Usyk. That's just my opinion. I, I, I've never thought. I've never felt or got the vibe that he really wants that fight. I've always felt that he just. He he, he doesn't want it. He doesn't want it, man. Um, but let's see what happens, man. Let's see what, let's see if this fight really happens. But leave your thoughts in the comment section below. Let me know what you think. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out, guys.